Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. If this is your first time here, welcome. My name's Lisa, I'm with Avon, and I'm an independent sales rep, and I also love to do beauty reviews, beauty hauls, tutorials, and this is one of my hype or hope videos. So today we're gonna be going over winged eyeliner and a new gadget that I found online that I'm wondering, is it hype or is there hope? I have had such problems with doing winged eyeliner and it's because I've gotten older and I have hooded eyes, so it makes it very difficult uh, to get a straight line. And so I found this little apparatus from Wings Cosmetics that I thought I would go ahead and order and try. Now I'm not sponsored uh, by Wings Cosmetics, I just wanted to try this out, so I just wanted to put out that disclosure. So I'm gonna go ahead and open this. This shipped from, let's see, uh, Texas, so it's not an overseas company. And it claims that you can do a winged eyeliner look. These ones are the classic uh, winged eyeliners. They have also one that is a little bit longer that you can order. They were about $12.99 um, and then plus shipping. I paid just under $20 to get these little plastic apparatuses. This is what they look like. So as you can see, and it's like a stamp. So you hold it by this, you paint the edge and then you stamp it to your eye. So this one would be for the right eye. So you would just get it right where you want your wing. As a matter of fact, I got it backwards. Hello, Lisa. You would get it right where you want your wing and then you would stamp it on. Now I have tried, initially, um, I wanted to try doing the whole thing, but after reading instructions, it does say to just paint the outer edge. So I got a couple different formulas here that I'm gonna try. So one of the first ones I have is liquid, and this is the NYX uh, collection uh, liquid liner. I also have an Avon one here that I'm gonna try. And this one is the Super Extend. So I will do the Super Extend on one eye and try this liquid, because one is more of a liquid and one is more of a pen. And then I also do have a cream pot as well. So this would be for my left eye. And so we're gonna go ahead and paint the edge here. So I'm nervous about this. I so want it to work. So you can paint the rest of your line, it says afterwards. So I'm just gonna get a good coat on here just for the wing. And we're gonna try this and see if this is hoop or hype, guys. Okay, so I've got my little edge painted, as you can see, this right here. And then we'll try uh, one of my Avon ones too. So I got some on the edge. I don't know if you need to be super neat. But I need my wing to extend upward here. And so I'm gonna to try to look in the mirror and do this. And let's see if we can get a good stamp. So let's see about this angle. I don't know. Let me look in the regular mirror. If I stretch that out, it's way up. I don't know, guys, if I could work that in. It looks a little ridiculous. It's way down low. Maybe I didn't position it right because um, it shouldn't be like that. But I don't know. Maybe if I use the proper liners underneath, it's not horrible. All right, let's try the other eye uh, with a different formula and see how that works. So we're going to now use the Avon Super Extend. Because again, you have to continue your line to make this work, but again, maybe I'm just not cut out to ever wear um, winged eyeliner. Okay, so this is more of a pen form, as you can see. So I'm painting this on, because I want to see which way works better. Is it better to have more of a liquid, or is that too? So I'm going to look in this mirror over here. Oh boy. Okay, so I made a little bit of a mess under here, but actually that didn't go on bad other than the giant mess. Oh my God, look at that. Okay, so I wasn't very neat. I look like I've just come out of prison or something and I need a teardrop or something. What the heck? Okay, so I got my moisture effective makeup remover so we can try it up a little bit. Does that look any better? Of course, I, look at that. That looks ridiculous like that. Oh my gosh. And that looks, now that, oh my gosh. Okay, so this is the classic. I can't even imagine what the one that is not the classic does to your eyes, because um, it's longer. 
So I'm trying to cheat out the hooded part and make this work and it doesn't look like it's working. So if I go ahead and try to color in the rest of my lines, it's still wonky in my opinion, it's still a little wonky. I'll let you guys be the judge. You guys can comment and say it's wonky or it's not bad or maybe with the rest of my makeup it's not bad. I think it looks like a bullhorn sticking out of the corner of my eye. I'm not really uh, digging it. I'm not really digging it. It's kind of... And then this one, I mean, let's try to fix that. I'll go ahead and use the NYX liquid on that and see how that works. I don't know guys. To me, maybe it's a hope for you and your eyelids, but for me and mine, I don't think this is working and I'm disappointed. Okay, so I just used my Avon concealer. This is the extra lasting and this is in the light shade and just kind of tried to clean up a little bit and I put on a little bit more mascara. I really don't have any eyeshadow on because I'm just trying to uh, use this stamp. So we're gonna go at it again. We're going to try this time with a cream pot. I've left this one on with a super extend. Um, I, I, I don't know guys. All right, so I'm gonna paint on my gel liner. We're gonna try gel liner and see if that makes any difference. And again, maybe this just takes practice. So this is pretty easy to paint on uh, over the little stick trying to use the liquid wand. So this seems to be a little easier. Um, let's see how it applies. So I've got just the tip, as you can see, on there to get the wing. I'm trying to take from the corner and I'm trying to look in my mirror. So let's just get to the corner of my eye and maybe angle it to this area. And stamp. Okay, is that any better? I don't know. Um, let me go ahead and try to fill in the gap so you can see there's a little bit of a gap in between there. The wing is pretty straight, um, but you would have to definitely fill in in the bottom and then fill in in the top. So let me go ahead and take my um, gel liner uh, on that and see if we can straighten that out just a little bit here and see if it makes any Okay guys, my verdict is in, um, and I'm using the makeup remover wipes made on there, pretty awesome, so let me just take this off. I am not happy. I am sad that this does not work in my opinion. Again, maybe if you don't have hooded eyes, maybe I could practice off camera and try, but as of right now, this for me is a hype. Um, it doesn't work for me. Maybe it will work from you. You can check out, like I said, at Wings Cosmetics and see if uh, the classic or maybe the longer works for you. Um, I figured I would take a chance. I happened to see it, wanted to see if it really would work because I really wanted to wear wing eyeliner, but I just don't think this is for me. So I want to thank you for your time. Uh, let me know if you have a eyeliner trick for winged eyeliner. Like I said, I've tried tape. I've tried uh, credit cards. I have tried doing it with the stamp now. I've tried gel liners. I've tried matching from the bottom. I've tried opening my eye and putting it a little higher. No matter what, it just doesn't work for my hooded eyes. I've just tried. So um, if you have a tip or something that works for you or a product that works for you to get a winged eyeliner look, let me know uh, in the description bar. You can check out more of my videos here on the channel. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And check out below in the uh, show more area for more information about different things that I do, uh, not only within the Avon world, but other videos and uh, information. So thanks for watching. Thanks for joining me and taking the time. Um, if you are thinking about ordering this, uh, maybe take a chance, see if it works for you. But for me, I think it's a total fail and it's definitely no hope for me. 
it's just hype. So have a great day and thanks for watching. Bye guys.